Hello and welcome. This video segment covers selecting objects within CATIA V5. So let's get started. CATIA gives you a few different ways to select objects for use in an operation. Like many other programs, CATIA helps you pick objects by moving the cursor over an object and clicking. To select multiple objects, press and hold Ctrl key while picking. The selection toolbar shows what selection mode you are using. You can only select objects when select is active, which it displays in orange on the selection toolbar. Once you start an operation, the icon becomes inactive. Sometimes when you exit an operation, the icon stays inactive requiring that you click it before you can select anything. You can also click the icon to cancel most operations. There are several ways to pick multiple objects in the graphics window. The simplest is to click and drag a rectangle around the objects in normal select mode. The trap options on the selection toolbar give different variations on this theme. Rectangle selection trap Selects everything that falls completely within the rectangle. Intersecting Rectangle Selection Trap selects every object that crosses the boundary of the trap, even if the object is not completely encased in the trap. Polygon Selection Trap Selects all objects that lie within a polygon that you define by picking points to create the polygon. Double click to end the trap. Freehand selection trap allows you to select objects by dragging a curve through them. Outside rectangle selection trap selects everything outside of the rectangle. This trap is the opposite of the rectangle selection trap. Outside Intersecting Rectangle Selection Trap selects everything crossing the boundary or outside of the rectangle. Finally, you can also select the part or object by clicking on its name on the specification tree. That completes this video. Thanks for watching. Join me next time.